Today is Thursday, March 18th at Irvine Journal. We're about to attend a reception at 3000 The Park, the high rise prize for the Irvine Public Schools Foundation annual raffle to raise money to help support the Irvine schools, which you know are in big trouble. I'm, I'm, I've got your line. I'm going to be passing that along. Right? Hmm. At the dream house, huh? It is. Boy, oh boy. Here's the view out the bedroom. You can even see way off in the distance. No, Saddleback. I just visited the $700,000 worth deluxe unit. Two bedroom, 14, 1,495 square foot, at a price of only $150. What do you think about that? We all have a chance to win. But you know what? This is a real win win situation. Every ticket that you sell. It's going to go towards our Irvine School District. Just think about that. I'm not going to preach the choir. Everybody's here. You're the supporter of school. And our education is the cornerstone of our, our community's success. So think about that and sell hell out of tickets. That's what we need. Thank you very much. Well, the raffle is our biggest fundraising initiative that we have for the foundation. And through the raffle, through the proceeds of the raffle, we're able to support enrichment programs such as art, music, science, health, the types of amazing programs that typically get cut because of the budget crisis that we're currently in in California. So all 27,000 students benefit. And this is a great way of engaging people that may otherwise um, not have given to, to the foundation. And they have a chance to win a luxurious uh, apartment or uh, a home here at 3000 The Plaza or a BMW or a vacation package. And they are also helping support a great cause. So. Right. so with the budget cuts affecting the arts and the sciences and the public schools next year, are you expecting that there'll be a significant increase in participation from parents and others in the community? Or? I think so. I think I think parents are a little surprised as to what's going on in our state. And we, Irvine is known for excellent schools and amazing track record and alumni that have gone on and done phenomenal things. And uh, we, we don't don't want to just stand back and let it happen. So we, we don't want the, we don't want to want the cuts affecting our, our schools like like they are around us, all around us. Nice. This year, the seventh annual raffle to support the Irvine Public Schools Foundation, probably more important than ever.